Oh my god. That's a logo if I ever saw one. Come here, come and look at this. Hey, logo boy! Oh crap. I'm saying to Jensen, I'm a hall cop. I'm gonna cover that logo before I cover it up for you. Joe Scourge, we need assistance immediately. We have a 1084 runner, huge logo, A-Hall boys bathroom. Come on, let's go, come on. All right, Ms. Jensen, I'm on my way. My name is Joseph Skirdich, and they, uh, they call me the enforcer. I don't know why, because I'm just doing my job, you know, just doing my job. I bust kids for dress code every day. That gets old. I send them to triple R like it's nothing, dragging them out of homeroom and whatnot. To be honest, <laughs> I'm a nightmare to these kids. We get this same junk every day. Every day somebody tries to be cute with their logo, their little t-shirt, it's the same garbage. The most difficult part about our job, uh, what would you say? Choosing shades of colors? Yeah, well, you got shades of gray. Pinks and blue. Oh yeah, especially gray. Gray is gray. gray. Slate gray. Stone gray. Daggum charcoal gray. <laughs> My cart's gray. That's good. <laughs> uh, Miss Gray, you know. That's uh, not a color. What? That's not a color. The hardest part of every day is definitely class changes. Here's an example right here. Hey, you with the cargo pockets. Me? Yeah, you. Come over here. Come on. See, this is the junk I'm talking about every day. Hey, what do you have in your pockets? Just pens and pencils. What? See, you never know what could be in these bad boys. Come on, man. What you really got in there? Just pens and pencils. Get in there. We'll see. So what do you really have in those pockets? I already told you, it's just pens and pencils. Well, then empty them out. No. Come on, empty them out. They're just shorts. I'm not asking you. I'm telling you, empty them out. Come on. Come on. Seriously. After all the contraband, Matt. It's literally just cargo shorts. I'm not a big deal. I know, I heard you. Come on, let's see what you got. For the third amount, oh, look, pens and pencils. Yeah, I'm sure. What else you got? Nothing. I think I see something right there. You Come on, throw it out. Oh my. What else you got? It's okay. A little knife. That's it. Oh, uh, there we go. Let's. What else you got? You got some sharp objects. No, there. that's look. it. Let me see. It. What else you got? Come on, throw it down. Wow. A shield. That's all I have. You carry a shield in your cargo pockets. <laughs> You don't know what you're going to come across nowadays. This is what I'm talking about. Easy. Our job? Easy? No way. I mean, what do you think we go through, like, 450 referrals a day? Easily, yeah. And some of them are dumb stuff, like chewing gum. Give me a break. And 500 emails are written by us every day. I mean, how many emails do you write by yourself? I play Shell Shock. Shell Shock? Yeah. <laughs> really? You play Shell Shock? Yeah. What website you get on? No mind, bro.
Ten bucks, people. Too easy. I get so sick and tired of measuring girls' skirts every day. They're talking about, Mr. Skirtage, it's three inches. This is not no dadgum three inches, people. And I swear, they should start measuring the boy shorts, too. Because they come in here wearing those, what you call it, those, uh, those chunky shorts, yeah. Chubby. Coming in here, what? Ch chubby. Chubby shorts, yeah. And, I mean, these dudes, how are you going to sit in there in class and take notes with the shorts riding up and your butt crack? We're coming to his finest. Not because of the kids. Because of us. Without us, these kids would be bent out of shape. So we'd crack down on them like a... Like a bullwhip. Be right there. Gotta go.